Now, why Ido Shun residents have now pledged to arrest and prosecute perpetrators of female genital mutilation. Now, a consensus building event at uh, Ido Shun Tao O emphasized the importance of reporting and prosecuting offenders. The event, facilitated by the Action Health Incorporated, uh, in the also Oshun State Ministry of Health and Women Affairs involved community leaders and law enforcement agents from the Nigeria Police Force, Nigerian Security and Civil Defence Corps, and the Western Nigeria Security Network Agency. The resolution aims to ensure the safety and justice of uh, the FGM offenders. So the consensus building that was organized at the Bedore local government area today was organized for the community leaders and law enforcement agents. This is just to create synergy between them, making them, enlightening them on the laws and uh, punishments, the penalties that are available for perpetrators of female genital mutilation. This is like the third stage of the project because we started with advocacy, followed by dialogue, and here we are with the consensus building just for the community leaders and law enforcement agents to come together. Uh, the female genital mutilation is a practice that is archaic, unhealthy, and totally unacceptable. And at this time, we must find a way to sustainably end the practice. And we must appreciate the effort of the UNFPA in finding a lasting solution to this scourge of cutting our daughters. And uh, the government of the country must also help in the education, in the enlightenment of the people concerned most importantly at the grassroots level. 